Hello guys, we are back with another video. Today we are <clears throat> scooting up a little bit. Today we are watching the final trailer for an indie film that a friend of mine is doing and it's called The Black Fist Part 1. And I am in this movie in like a very small role. She was there while I was shooting my scenes. Mm -hmm. um, and I'm going to be brutally honest, and I know that Jaden, the guy who made this movie, is going to be watching this, so I will be brutally honest. Um, first things first. I don't know what to feel, how to feel about uh, the fact that this movie is three and a half hours long. <laughs> because that's longer than Avatar The Way of Water and that movie I don't care what any of my, my subscribers say or where they stand on it I, I could, could not, not stand, stand that, that movie. movie that movie bored me out of my mind James Cameron thought it would be cool to shove all these whales and, and fish and, and water splashes in it and he's like hey it, look, it looks cool so they'll like it I went to see it in IMAX 3D, and the only good thing I can say about it is it genuinely had probably the best visuals I've ever seen in a movie, but that did not by any means save the movie. I thought that movie was bad. The story was just boring, and it was, it was literally 20 minutes worth of story stretched out to 3 hours and 15 minutes. Now, I'm not saying that's what's going to happen with this movie. I don't know what to feel about this movie. I don't know what to think about this movie. I haven't even really watched a lot of the trailers. Um, I see Jaden post some stuff here and there, and I've kind of been trying to avoid it because I told him I didn't want to be spoiled very much, but now I'm going to watch his trailer with my wife, and it's uh, two and a half minutes long, which is a good length for a trailer. I'm not trying to dog on any of your work, Jaden, but I'm just saying, for your first movie, I don't, it, it's a... It's a very bold move to make a three and a half hour movie because if people end up not liking it, even if the cast likes it, the audience is a whole different playing field. And if they end up not liking it, then you set yourself up for failure with the next movie. I'm going to go in with an open mind, but right from the get-go, I'm a little nervous because of the length of the movie. Uh, the, the trailer don't... It's kind of fuzzy because he said... Uh, he said that it's a little fuzzy. The, mo the, the footage looks better, but he had a problem with the uploading, and it's only in 480p. Oh. So it doesn't. it's going to be kind of blurry. Okay. But just ignore that and pay attention to the actual... I hope it's good for his That sounds morbid. Okay, I'll rephrase that. For it being three and a half hours long, I hope the story is really, really good. Excellent work, Captain. You have pleased me. There is a disturbance that has been quite an irritation to the United Sisters. Agent Kent has gone on his own little errand to pursue a band of miscreants. I want you to replace him.
use your kind so cowardly, running at the nearest glimpse of adversity in your sick little feeble life. Oh, there's me. Well, the last part got interesting. Who are you? What happened? Right off the bat, I gotta say, the audio has a lot of problems. Yes. Um, in yep. this, it sound it almost sounds like a lot of it was being recorded off a TV onto a phone. Like a recording was being played through a TV and then recorded onto a phone and then put on this. It sounds very muffled. A lot of it sounds muffled. Yeah. But here, here's go ahead. What do you what, do? You, do you want me to go or do you want to go? I only have one thing to say. What's that? My only issue, like some of these shots look like look really good. Like very, very well done. But then other shots, um, I'm not sure how I feel about all the times I saw people looking at the camera. You saw people looking at the camera? Yes. I maybe saw it once. Nope, there was like seven different times. And I think some of it was on purpose. But I don't know if the others were on accident or not. So I didn't know how to feel about it. Okay. That's what you have to say. I didn't notice. I, I might have seen one time. I don't remember. I wasn't really focused on that. I was I was just thinking to myself, man, this would look this would look better if it was in 1080p. <laughs> anyway. Um I'm still not hundred percent sold on the movie. Sorry, Jaden. Um I'm skeptical, like I feel a lot of people were with my first movie, so don't take this too hard. It's just that when you're doing your first movie, you have a lot to prove. There is a lot resting on your shoulders with that, and some people with their first movie, they don't stick the landing. Others do. It, it really depends, and it's a gamble, it's a roll of the dice, and you learn from it whatever happens however this is gonna go um one main criticism i have is the actors are all not all of them but most of them are too young and it's fine if they're too young i can look past that because in my first movie everyone was like under the age of 22 um and some of them were supposed to be like 40 year olds like i was supposed to be 35 in my first movie and i was 19. Well, i didn't even do i didn't even do makeup on myself so Thanks, she says I look old. I like it. Anyway. Anyways, um, we're going to crop that. No, we're not. We're keeping that. No! All right, so... <laughs> so, uh, so the, the actors look older, no, look younger than I think they're supposed to be. Mm -hmm. Except I know a couple of them are supposed to be kids, and that's fine. I know, I know it's harder to get adults to play roles, than it, and it's a lot easier to get younger people. Um, but that is something that will draw a lot of criticism from not just me, but a lot of people. I got so much crap for that in my first movie. They're like, but people weren't the right age. Only a couple of characters were the right age. That's the main thing. Um, some of the shots did look good. Others were kind of in middle of the road. Um, it's, it's apparent that, that this wasn't entirely shot by someone who knows all the ins and outs of angles and stuff um the audio had some issues and i really don't know what the story is like there's some battle that was lost they're still in a fight with some organization called the black fist is what i think it is and then Jaden's playing this character called uh the reaper who's this guy in the mask well. and i don't know what his purpose like what his his, um, I don't know what his role is in the story. I don't really know what my significance is to the story. He's told me a few things, but I don't fully get it. And I feel like none of the trailers have really told me much. Like, I know there's things happening, but I don't really understand the things happening. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of the trailers feel uh, like you're trying to show certain things that are interesting without showing the surrounding context and I wish I had more context to like 
understand what I'm walking into, which I still don't know what I'm really walking into with this trailer. So. Okay, I'll say what I gathered from it then. Go ahead. It seems like there's a group of either kids, or maybe they're supposed to be adults, it's just they're too young to be adults, I don't know. Um, there's a group of people that they're after, and it looks like they are torturing them, and my brain kind of disconnected, like maybe they're trying to like run some experiment on them, and they escaped, I don't know. That's what I got from it. Okay. Yeah, I, I don't know, I don't know really what to feel. In all honesty, I'm not necessarily excited, but I'm interested to watch it and see how it turns out. Um, and I will post an honest review of the movie after I watch it. That's all I really have to say. I, I'm middle of the road on this thing. I don't. I don't have necessarily bad feelings, but I don't have really good feelings either. I'm just, I'm here, I absorb, I absorb the content, and I guess we'll see on Thursday, because the movie comes out on Thursday, this so. This week, yay. Yes, and I will post a link to the tickets that he's selling for this movie, if anybody wants to go watch it, um, if you live nearby, and I'll also put a link to his channel and the trailer for everyone to check out so they can support Jaden and his future projects. But that is my thoughts on the tra final trailer for Black Fist Part 1. Do you have anything else? I am being hopeful. <laughs> I, I, I genuinely think that for his first movie, from what I've gathered from watching that trailer, it looks all right. The costumes were actually pretty good. On, I will say that, yes, yes. The costuming and the guns look pretty good. Yes. So you did an excellent job with the costumes. Um, I really hope the audio is louder in the movie. Though. I think there was just an audio issue with the upload. I don't know. I I couldn't really tell what was said I don't, in some parts. Yeah. It, it was difficult to tell at points. But other than that, um, it looks... It looks it, it looks pretty decent. I am I'm going to be there on Thursday and I will give an honest review of it afterwards and post it on my channel. So that is all.